What's up, party people? It's your boy Xavier with the Chicago Children's Theater, here to show you some more dance moves specific to hip hop. But before we get started, here are some things to remember about hip hop. The relationship between your body and the earth is important. As much gravity and bounce as you can give your body, the better. You remember that? You'll be all good. All right, so for today's video, we've got seven dance moves that we're gonna put all together in one song for this sequence. You ready? Here we go. The first dance move is called a step touch with a bounce. You know, the bounce is just a little bit more oomph with your body, you know, the feeling that you have. So let's do it. So right together, left together. You see the body undulation? Just add that. Right, uh, left, uh, right, uh, left, uh. It looks great. All right. All right, for move number two, it's very similar to the first one. It's a step touch, but with an arm cuff, what I like to call an arm cuff. So let me show you. The way to do that is you step with your right, you bring your right arm around, and you step up with your left. And then for the left, you step out, bring that right arm down, bring that left arm up, and then you bring your right foot in. It's like a U shape you make with your body, right? Great, so the next move is the woe, which I'm sure you know all about from TikTok and everything else that's out there. So, how do you do it? So, from our previous move, we go from that cuff, we step left, bring that right arm down, scoop up that left, but instead of finishing that cuff, we're going to bring that right up and toss the coin up. We look, count one, two, and we Finish the woe. You see that? It's kind of like you're driving a steering wheel, right? And you add some attitude. You can add your neck rolls and some shoulder rolls. So you throw it up. Here we go. It's like you're getting ready to drive, right? Following the woe part two, we've got the quick floss. What's the quick floss? You already know that from Fortnite and every other TikTok dance out there. But how do you do it slowly? So. You step your arms out, left. You bring your left hip through. You bring your left hip back out. Swing your arms in front, and you bring your right hip through. You bring your right hip back in, swing your arms in front, left hip. Swing in front, right hip. Swing in front, left hip. Right? We're gonna do a double time though. So we're gonna do left, right, left, right. So fast, you got it. All right, we are on our second to last move, but it's also our hardest. So please feel free to pause this video, rewind this section back and forth until you feel comfortable doing it. You ready? That move is called the reject. Ever heard of it? Probably not, it's from the early 2000s. That's from my time, sorry, I'm old. So how do you do the reject? It's a little bit like skipping, but backwards. Skipping, 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 forward skipping, forward skipping, forward skipping. Backward skipping, backward skipping, backward skipping, backward skipping. Yeah? So, where we left off. We were doing the quick floss. Ba, 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 ba. Then we step forward on that left foot. We're gonna put all of our weight on it. See the right foot dangling back here? We're gonna hop back on that foot. Then we're gonna hop forward on that same foot. Don't take it off. Then we're gonna put the left foot back down. It's so hard to do it slow. So let's do it faster. Forward, back, forward, back, forward, back, forward, back, forward, back, forward, back, forward. Having fun with it, you know. Yeah, you're killing it. Okay, we are here at our final dance move. It's our showstopper. I'm gonna have to take my shirt off for this one so that you can see my footwork. This one is called the pin drop. So, we just left off with our fast rejects, correct? But instead of finishing that four count, we're gonna go one, two, three, four. Bring that left foot up to the outside of your right knee. You should be able to fall 
right onto that foot under your knee without having your knee hit the ground. See that foot down there? I know. And with your feet and legs all tangled up like this, you just swivel counterclockwise and end in your hip hop cool pose. Look how cool you look. All right, now that you've got all the moves, it's time to put them all together in our hip hop dance sequence. It's pretty hard, so feel free to pause it, go back to the beginning, and start all over. We've all got each other's backs. Is everyone ready? Hit it, DJ D. Video. Check out Chicago Children's Theater YouTube for more videos.